want to get better lighting on your Bamboo Lab A1 and A1 Mini. Follow along, and I'll show you how to do it quickly and affordably. To improve the lighting, I found these affordable lighting kits on AliExpress. They're simple, cost-effective, and work perfectly for our Bamboo Lab A1 and A1 Mini. Let's take a look at what's included. Each kit comes with a self-adhesive LED strip, connected to a cable with a connector of the AMS and a switch. It's everything we need to set up better lighting without spending too much, you have the link in the description. First, let's install the lighting on the A1 Mini. The process is straightforward, and you won't need any tools. Start by moving the print head out of the bed to be able to work properly, and turn off the printer to avoid problems. Next, it is time to install the light strip on the X-axis. Before installing check, what's the best position to put it? I recommend that you keep it centered. These lights come with adhesive backing, so just peel and stick, making sure to align everything neatly before installing it. Install the strip of lights very carefully to avoid damaging it or the printer. Check if the printing head has free movement and push up the strip. To secure the cable and prevent it from falling or causing us any problem, I chose to put a tie on the printer cable to move without interfering with going up vertically. Once everything is secured, plug it in, make sure to check the connector orientation and don't force it during the installation. To check how it looks, turn on the printer and switch on the light. It's a huge difference, isn't it? Now there is a lot more light, it's perfect for a dark room like mine and to check the printing process with the camera at night. As you can see it adapts perfectly to the printer and allows the print head to move freely. The process to install on the Bamboo Lab A1 is the same. The kit comes with a longer strip and you can choose between installing on the X-axis or in the top bar. I will install mine on the X-axis following the same steps. Check the position and peel off the back of the strip. Push it firmly making sure you're installing it carefully. It's a longer one so make sure it's straight to avoid issues when the print head will move. If you install it at the top bar you can be less exigent. As before I recommend you to use a zip tie to secure the LED strip cable with the one of the printer to avoid it fall on the build plate. Check the connector orientation and connect to the free AMS slot. You must know that if you have to AMS connect it you will not be able to install this. Let's check if this also works and what's the lightning effect. And that's it! I think that this lightning is awesome, it illuminates the whole build plate and looks cool in addition, you can turn the light on and off with just one button. Here's the final result, with the new lighting installed, both the A1 and A1 Mini are much brighter, making it easier to check on prints and monitor progress. What do you think of this lighting upgrade? Let me know in the comments. Have you tried something similar, or are you thinking about upgrading your printer's lighting? And if you'd like more easy upgrade tips, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching and happy printing!